Okay, this is probably not the video you were wanting for Saturday, but here it is. So, this is a sort of refactor on what I wanted originally for my um, quick shell configuration. And it's getting to the point where I am ridiculously getting overly impressed with it. Uh, as you can see right here, we now have an improved media. So, we hit play. It starts counting up. From the seconds it shows the album art and everything else and if we go in here you're going to notice the performance tab is gone instead the performance metrics are moved up here which is so much better by the way and i've also completely and utterly fixed my weather tab so now that it shows a lot better and the other cool part is we now have a reload hyperland and quick shell button the old one wasn't working so for some reason i made a new one it also shows that I'm on Cache OS, which is really, really nice. And is that all I did? I believe so. Oh, the animations for this also has changed. Uh, now, the thing I'm still having issues with is the year of the uh, album is not being shown right here. And I wanted a tiny bar down here that would show how much time is left like it would go up as the song went on right but you can only fit so much onto a dock without it looking ridiculous and i think i'm at my limit with this it looks nice it's constrained and honestly it just works which i'm happy about and as for this this just bugs me um we did have to replace the fog icon with an svg instead of an icon because the emoji for a fog is absolutely ridiculous it's the dumbest looking thing i've ever seen and it's not fully transparent so this this looks a little more foggy and makes me a little happier and as for this watch this still broken i don't get it i really 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 don't get it like let's go to this Now it's working. I know what's going on. I, I know what's going on. Pseudo Pac-Man dash RDD Easy Effects. Goodbye. May you rest in hell for all eternity. So now when I switch to this, well, that shouldn't even be there, but it is. Back to here. No? Can we get rid of anything else easy related? No, it doesn't let us. We'll probably have to restart Pipewire to get that done. But it's good to know that it's not broken. And that I can actually control it, which is nice. We just had to set it to the easy uh, effects sync. That makes a lot more sense, honestly. And to show you that this actually does work, we quick balanced and then we go up here. It's also unbalanced up here, so that's good. So the entire thing has been completely reworked, which is nice. Uh, it also runs a lot cleaner too. I fixed a bunch of warnings, a bunch of other issues. So yeah, not to mention that, oh, man, it did it again. Why you like this? Why, why can't you just keep my theme? What, why you gotta be like that? So mad now, like, you don't even understand. Like, let me have my Tahoe Dark. Quit being that guy. You goofy little friggin' shit. <laughs> Nautilus dash Q. Open it up and it's still not there. What are you doing and why are you doing it? Okay. Let's try with gnome tweaks because honestly. This is just dumb. Where is it? Like, why can't you just let me be happy? You're just so bad. Okay, let's try it this way. Uh, refine. Uh, do I have refine installed? I do. Good. Can we open it? We can. And, yeah, that's my main problem. Look at that. Man, 
<sighs> Whatever. I'll fix it later. That's all that matters. What was the application called? E. Oh. Evolve icons consistent of square icons theme core three. Okay. I'm going to install this. Because I want to set that back immediately to what it was. Because I do not like it existing like it was. Okay. Do that. You guys uh, need to make a gnome shell theme for this. Because honestly, it looks really, really good. And it would really like suit everything else to have that done. Probably going to have to change this to this and that to that and that to that. And then we go back and we change it to Tahoe Dark. Tahoe Dark. And that. And that's probably not going to look right because we probably need to kill Nautilus. Yeah, it's just not letting us set it at all now, which is disappointing. It is what it is. It happens. It's sad, but it happens. Enter a name. Set up theme. I don't want to. Go away. Go away. There we go. All right. So that's what's changed in my overall layout with Quickshell. Uh, pretty simple stuff. Nothing major. Just really does help all together with uh, the look I'm trying to go for, I guess. I'm probably going to end up removing this. While it's nice and it's interesting, I don't know. It just doesn't fit anymore since I just upgraded this and made this completely work. I also removed the to-do list so the calendar always shows. That's another cleanup thing that I did, but yeah, we're making progress on things. Okay, well, it's gone now. It's kind of gotten away, to be honest, because every time you went and hovered up there or even went around here to, like, to do anything, it would instantly get in your way and cause a whole bunch of issues. So I'm glad that it's gone. I'm going to go listen to this song because it's a goddamn good song. Even today, it's amazing. And I hope you guys have a great weekend. I'm not going to have a video for you on Sunday that I know of yet. And I'm going to see my kids now. Bye, everybody. Um, if you ever want to support the channel, become a member on YouTube. It's super cheap. It's effective. It helps. It's like $1.99. You know? So that really helps me out in the long run. Keeps me... Uh, you know, in place, in an apartment, uh, making videos for you. So yeah, uh, if that is not enough, you can just subscribe. That is probably the best, liking the video, leaving a comment, feeding that annoying little algorithm. And I'll see you guys next time. Hope you enjoy the changes. I'll upload them to GitHub soon once everything is stable.